hey everyone this is kapil and welcome to my youtube channel in this video we will see how you can join your windows 10 to a domain so first of all you need to configure the dns settings for your windows 10 so right click on start button select run and in the run type ncpa.cpl i repeat ncpa.cpl and click ok then under network connections window right click on your primary network adapter and select properties on the property sheet you need to select internet protocol version 4 and then click on properties so another window is open you need to select use the following dns server address option here and type in the domain's dns server address you can obtain this information from domain administrator or your it person i am just putting here my own values but you can put you have to put actual values applicable in your case and select the validate settings upon exit option and click ok then hit the close button and exit all the windows as you have changed DNS settings, network adapter troubleshooter or Windows network diagnostics may start working. So simply close on it and now we will open settings app. So right click on start button and click settings. As you can see settings app is now open. Go to accounts. Then select access work or school. Click on connect in the right pane. On the Microsoft account window. You need to click on join this device to a local active directory domain. The second link under alternate actions you have to click on that okay so we have now joined a domain window where you can type the domain name so i'm typing my domain name here and then i will click on next now windows will verify the domain information once it found it correct it will be asking for the permission on domain so here basically uh, the domain administrator has to provide uh, his information here like his username and password on the domain and hit on the ok button once the information is verified the an account can be added uh, so here the username should be uh, existing on the domain and be careful to select the user account here if a standard user is selected the user won't have administrative rights and if this administrator is selected the user have administrative rights so select your preferred option and click on next then you will be asked for restarting the PC so that domain connection can be completed so click on restart now button after restarting your system you should be on the login screen by default it takes you to the machine and login then but you need to select the user account for domain login so i have selected the user account for domain login and now typing its password okay i have typed the password for the domain account and pressed enter key so we are now logging into the domain account we have just added uh, this uh, domain account is uh, finally logged in 
uh, we will just verify if our windows 10 is now connected to domain or not so we'll simply click, uh, click or right click on the start button and select settings After opening settings app, go to accounts, then select access work or school. Okay, so finally we have been confirmed here that the Windows 10 has been successfully joined to domain. In case if you face any issues while joining your Windows 10 to domain, do let me know via your comments. Uh, I will try to help you as soon as possible. And thanks for watching this video. If you found it helpful, do like it, share it and subscribe to my YouTube channel.